Hello everybody, happy Father's Day to all you fathers in Australia. Father's Day today. So, my wife has uh, treated me to um, 10 days with the uh, children. Not sure how that one worked out. Anyway, yeah, so my wife Hayley, she's, she's actually flown back to the UK for 10 days. Um, it's um, my mother-in-law, Hayley's mum, Elaine Rich, it's her birthday next week. Big 70th, so yeah, she's throwing a party for the family and friends. So Hayley's gone back to help celebrate with her. Um, a little bit sad that we can't be there with her, unfortunately. But distance and, um, yeah, me having to work and kids with the schools and stuff like that. Um, it's just prevented us all from going over, unfortunately, which is a little bit sad. But uh, anyway, I'm here with the kids, so celebrating Father's Day. Um, Hayes back in the UK, having some, hopefully, some uh, downtime, chilling out with friends and family, relaxing. Yeah, so we shall see her in not too long, but until then, making the most of being with the kids, me and them. And uh, yeah, well, here's one now. Hi. <laughs> so, we have been busy already on Father's Day. Since we moved to our new place, right near the water, we felt it was a must to get some kayaks, to drop them in the kayak drop off jetty just down the road so we've been on facebook marketplace this morning we've got what you got to say birds noisy aren't they anyway we bought some uh, life jackets we bought some soft roof racks so we could drop a kayak on the roof which we've done so we've got a kayak we've got paddles we've got a seat for the kayak so yeah we're all good to go so we're going to wheel the kayak down the road to the jetty point chuck it in the water <coughs> excuse me suffering a bit at the moment a bit of a sore throat too much work i think or yeah not enough sleep but uh, anyway enough of that so yeah we're gonna go down the boat ramp and drop the kayak in and sam has got his fishing gear and the crab net as well so we're gonna make the most of being in this beautiful country and beautiful weather enjoy the outdoors See how we go, so we'll check in soon people. See you soon. See you soon. So yeah, Hayley being in the UK, it's quite weird really, um, me being with the kids, because since the kids have been born, she's literally spent every single minute of every day with them. So, I think in the future, it will definitely have done them some good, having, uh, grown up with a mum right by the side right the way through their life really good sense of bonding there between the three of them which is which is great but I also think hey being away would do us some good actually and absence makes the heart grow fonder and I think the children will hopefully appreciate when she is here appreciate appreciate her a little bit more um, probably me even me as well she does so much for us at home with uh, the cooking, the cleaning, and generally just work, looking after our well-being and make sure we're all in a good place. She she always puts everyone before her and always has done in life, friends, family, and uh, yeah, I think it's about time she put herself at the front for once. So hopefully, just being away on her own, she she can do that and and enjoy it, and then come back. We. Yeah, get back on with family life and we'll certainly make sure we uh, try and look after her a bit more, I think, moving forward. So, yes. So, 70th birthday for Nanny Rich. Um, she's actually going to be coming out here in January, February? February next year. So, that's another part of the reason why we haven't all flocked back for for her birthday knowing that we're going to see her in a few months and we'll be able to try and have a celebration with her then and with granddad as well and then myself uh, i'll have to try and see my family at some point but we shall see right anyway let's crack on enjoy the day see you soon cheerio hey y'all so we're en route to 
the kayak drop off point. We've got our kayak with our wheels to wheel down there, same as we've got his rod. Georgia's on the exercise equipment. Georgia, that's very lazy. Using one leg. Come on, do it properly. Oh, yes, mate. Can we go now? Yep, let's go. Ready? Got it? Do you want me to hold the rod? You want me to hold the kite? Okay. I can do it. It's just, I just don't want to. Okay, let's go. What is I don't know. There's nothing to worry about. What are you going to catch today? A cold? Hoping to catch. Catch a cold? Hoping to catch a flathead. Oh, a flathead. Oh, nice. Georgia, what are you going to catch? You don't know. We're gonna have a fun time anyway. On Father's Day. Father's Day, 2023, Ormiston, Australia. <laughs> floating away. What? You're floating away. Oh so, my god! Oh, oh my so, god! So, Sam was caught big and. <laughs> Sam, what are you caught? A weed. A weed. <laughs> Can you get it out? Yeah, I'll get it out. Hold on. I'll do it, darling. Yeah. Sam, George, hold that. <laughs> I caught it. Well done, Sam. A great catch. I know. You was pulling it. Can you put these four on there, please? And a hook. Yep. Okay. Bit of excitement. Oh, well, I thought... So there is the kayak. Been out for a little whiz around. It's really good actually. Can't persuade Samuel on there today. Samuel's um, said it's a bit too windy, so he's a fair weather kayaker. We'll get him on there, don't worry. Yeah, we've been giving some bait down at the uh, boat ramp. So we've got some fish and some prawns and we're chucking them in the water. See if we get any joy. Aye, aye. Right. Some prawns. Got some prawns, Georgia. You're hungry, you want a snack? So I've been joined by my my friend Sean from football. He's here with his children. You're live on camera, no swearing. Catching nothing. <laughs> <laughs> you look the part though, mate. That's all that matters. <laughs> Sam, we caught a massive weed. What are you caught? Crisps. 